In this video we're going to have a look at transforming the graph of a function. So we've done two videos previously on transformation of functions and we're just going to apply this further to a graphical situation as we can see in this exam question here. So it says the graph of y equals f of x from minus 2 to 4 is shown above. Sketch the graph of y equals 2 f of x from minus 2 to 4 on the axes provided. Well in this one we're going to have to draw our own axes, we haven't got the axes drawn. So let's have a go at it. So drawing the axes, nice big diagram. So we can see it's been multiplied by 2 on the outside. So just making some notes on this, it's a stretch, scale factor 2. parallel to y axis. We can see that because it's been times by 2 on the outside and outside transformations do what they say they're going to do to the y values. So every y value is going to be times by 2. So our first y value at minus 2 is minus 2, 0. Timesing 0 by 2, we still get 0. This other one here, the y coordinates 2 on the axis, so we're going to double that to get 4. Our next y coordinate, 2, 1. The y coordinate's 1, so we're going to double it to get 2. So now the point is 2, 2. And we had uh, 4, 1. We're going to double the y coordinate 1 to get 2. So it's going to look something like this. So it's exactly the same graph with all the y coordinates having been doubled. Doing it in pencil in case it goes wrong. So that if it does, we can draw it again. And there's that graph there. So part two. It says, describe the transformation which transforms the graph of y equals f of x to the graph of y equals f of x minus one. Well, notice that we've taken one. Taking away makes it a translate. And we've taken 1 away on the inside. When things happen inside the bracket, it does the opposite to the x values. So we're actually going to add 1 to x and nothing to y. For more resources like this, subscribe to our YouTube channel or go to alevelmathsrevision.com.